Let us pray. I deserve the truth. God, let your light shine on I don't know what you're talking about. I saw you. Beloved wife, mother. I know you. Sister, How long? Daughter and friend. We pray that they may rejoice in your holy comforts. A few weeks. Oh. You can hurt no one but yourself if you make a scene. The only person getting hurt today is you. <laughs> well, you must have given us the wrong account number. No, we have a contract, Frank. You can't do that. Oh. He hung up on me. That's what I like about horses. No back chat. Problem? I have to ring the bank. I threw out our wedding album because it it hurt too much to remember. <clears throat> but then it hit me today that remembering's all I've got now, and it's it's not enough. It was it's only two years. I want to remember us raising Molly together, having more kids, coming home to her every night, falling out over the little things, making up again. I want to hear her telling me off for being too neat. I want to nag her for not eating right. We were supposed to have a lifetime together. I've had to rethink everything without her. She was the most amazing person I ever met. She, uh, she changed me for the better. She gave me my beautiful daughter. She was, she was mad enough to love me no matter what. So please, everyone, if Remember, Jenny. <laughs> Remember how kind and funny and brilliant she was. <laughs> Help keep her alive for me and Molly. Must have been very hard indeed. And now it's time for Jenny's sister, Chastity, to say a few words. I'm basically deader than Jenny. Surely they can transfer the money back from the wrong account. Yeah, they're looking into it, but it'll take weeks. It's my fault for getting the account number wrong. Oh, I might as well pack up my desk now. That'll be Frank again. Let him stew. I can't. He'll cancel the entire sound contract if he don't get paid today. Pay him, then. I need Declan's authorization to do another big transaction, and he's not in a happy place right now. You have mine. I can't do that. I can't invest in a festival with no music. You'll be doing me a favour. I suppose it might give me time to figure something out. And keep your job. If I let you help me, there won't be any funny business in return. I thought we'd moved on from all that. Good. One of the first times that I met Jenny, my dad tried to grow up her and she thought he was a tramp. <laughs> oh, I, um, I helped him find her, but um, I'm ashamed to say that I didn't handle that very well, because I was jealous. 
God, I wish I knew then what I know now. That I was lucky to have her. That I almost didn't know her, and I am so grateful that I did. <sighs> she did her head in sometimes, though. Yeah, she, um, she always thought that she knew best. And I always thought I knew better. <laughs> we had a massive row before she died. I accused her. I accused her of trying to hurt me. I warned her that she wouldn't be my sister anymore. But you know what? All along, she was the only one that was looking out for me. God, I wish she was here to help me through what's coming. Nikhil was right. Don't take the time you have with someone for granted. Because you never know when you're gonna lose them. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Right, um, now, all of you will know that Jenny was blessed with a truly beautiful singing voice. And Brenda and Nikhil would like to celebrate that by sharing this with everyone. And when I touch you, I feel happy inside. It's such a feeling that my love, I can't hide, I can't hide, I can't hide. Oh, yeah. No. Chess. No, no, no. We are not doing this. You do not say a word until my sister is in the ground. You don't get to ruin this. You don't get to make it worse because you have done enough. I uh, just need a quick word with Declan. And you are? I ran the build on the glamping site. Oh, sorry, you look all up the same to me. He's out. I'll come back later. I won't bother, is it a funeral? Local, is it? Mm, the village. We don't need you hassling him. <sighs> Transaction successful, Harley. Flippin' Lou, yeah. Happiness? Mm hmm. Thanks to you. Don't let on to Declan that he almost had a silent festival. Consider it zipped. You know, most people would have sat back and enjoyed seeing him fail after what he's done to you. I'm not most people, Nicola. Ensure and certain hope of eternal life through our Lord Jesus Christ, who will reform our bodies, that they may be conformed to his glorious body, who died and rose again for us. To him, glory be forever. Amen. Amen. Bye, sweetheart. Sleep tight. <laughs> May God give you comfort and his peace, his light and his Chance joy nice. in this world and the next. And the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit be among you and remain with you always. Light spill. What? You heard. Oh, back off, Dad, it's a funeral. <laughs> Trust Jazz to make it all about her. They were very close at the time, though. Until recently, anyway, by all accounts. That poor lad has lost his wife, but he managed to keep his bum on his seat. What's all this about? Jazz walked out of the funeral. But she came straight back in. <laughs> this is supposed to be a solemn occasion, Diane, not the okey cokey. She was overwhelmed with grief. And who can blame the girl? Well, sit yourself down. I'll get you a drink. Oi! Cheeky man! Ah! 
feel better. <sighs> I could smash every glass in this pub and it won't be enough. What did he do? Oh, I get lost. I need to think. I'm not leaving until I know what he did. <sighs> Debbie. I knew it. Eh? He did. Debbie. Zach, take your hat. Uh, two glasses of red. Oh, that's yeah, well, just help yourself and then pass some glasses round. Mum, there's a week on in case you hadn't noticed. Oh, a bit slap, this, isn't it? Excuse me? We know I'd have thought by now I'd at least have a glass in one hand, a bottle in the other. Such a touching picture of grief. Cameron's in charge. Have a go at him, all right? <laughs> Chaz, please. Oh. Dad! Tell him not to bother filling that hole in June. We've got another one to stick in the ground. Wind your neck again. Have you got no respect? He hasn't done all that much. Kind dingle, everyone. King of the empty fret. Don't you dare! This is my fight. What is your problem? I've made my decision, all right? Punch him all you want. I won't change my mind. Hang on, what decision? What are you talking about? She saw the pair of you, and I told her that she was losing it. She saw straight through you from the start. Things happen, Chess. Don't pretend you don't know what that's like. You make them happen! What is it? You get off on it, don't you? Is it the chase? Winning back someone that you think you can't have? Well, that's not what it was like, I swear well, to I'm you. I'll tell you exactly how it was for me. Cos I spent the last few days of Jenny's life hating her. I hated her for not supporting me. I hated her for not seeing what I saw in him. And now that she's dead, I can't take it back. I can't take any of it back. Chaz, I'm sorry. Don't you dare touch me! Don't you even look at me! I've change things I want! Can you bring my sister back? Then get out! I think you'd better do what she says. Get out, you poison bitch! Just go. Come on. What exactly did they say? I wanted to know if we'd come across anything unusual during the build. And what did you tell them? Nothing. That's what we agreed. Good. But when we made that agreement, the police went on the cards. And? Pick of the risk, I the reward. That's all they say, isn't it? How much? Ten grand. Cash. Better for both of us that way. You come by the site tomorrow. She can't hide forever. I don't care where she is. She's going to regret picking up that phone. Forget Katie. All that matters now is stopping this. It's stopped. The festival's a matter of days away. They can't start digging without any evidence. Yeah, well, we better pray that you're right. You should have said. Like Jenny did. Debbie needs her head testing. Fancy bundling her in a car and putting the wind up her with a shotgun. Don't you lose it like she did. You know what? If I had one now, you wouldn't be able to stop me. He's the one that needs ending. Damn right. <sighs> God, I'm thick. You must have known something was up. I ignored all the warning signs. And I forgave him everything because he was the best thing that had happened to me in a long He's time. He's a cancer. Well, he was there for me when I had nothing else. And she was sticking the knife in. When you were... God, how can he leave me now? You've dodged a bullet. God, you would not believe the day I've had. You're back early. My mobile's on divert. I had to get out of there. Ugh, the festival's giving me heart failure. 
Oh, and Megan's only gone and rented the stables to Steve, of all people. You know, if I have to sit through one more round of macho posturing between him and Declan, I'm... Sounds like you could use one of these. Hello. Hiya. Sorry, I was kidding. Oh, don't mention it. I won't be letting myself get carried away this time. This is a surprise, Jimmy. Well, the pub was chock-a-block and I was exhausted after my shift, so Steve thought we could come and have a quiet drink with you. She must have seen something in it. In one single look? Yeah, and then she wouldn't stop going so then on about it. why don't you just lie? Well, I tried to, but you know what she's like. Listen, hey, at least it's out now, right? I mean, that's, that's what we wanted. No. No, Cameron. Not like this. Oh, look. It's like Romeo and Juliet, but with more slags. Just dump the stuff and go, Chaz. Look at her little face. Not so mouthy now. She's the other woman, is she? Leave it out. Do you want putting on the floor again? If you want to batter me, then just do it, because I can't feel any worse. As if smacking you would make anything better. Right. So what do you want? I want to know why you think you can be happy with him after all this. After he's cheated on both of us, just like you said he would. I can't explain. <sighs> I know. It hurts. I buried my sister today. No hurt compares to that. So, I'm sorry. I don't want to fight you. You know what? I won't fight you. Because I'm better than you. Both of you. Because you are cold and twisted and selfish. You don't deserve to be even breathing while she lies there dead. So you love each other? What do you two know about it? You're both too messed up to love anyone but yourselves. You can rot together. I hope it was worth it. Did she ever go with him again? He's a dirty cheat. Yeah, the dirtiest. He's not right good at it, though. He always gets found out. I thought he hated Debbie. In fact, I thought Debbie hated him. Oh, it's beyond me. Bye. Listen, uh, I'm really sorry, but something's come up at work and we're going to have to head off. Actually, I was hoping to have a word. So, walk you out. All right. How's Charles? Bad. She just dumped her stuff at Debbie's. Is she there now? <sighs> she just wants to be left alone. What is Debbie thinking? <sighs> She's not thinking. We'll have to do it for her. What's that supposed to mean? We're gonna have to knock some sense into her, Zach. No, you leave them be. All right, well, fine. Maybe tonight. No, for good. Stop your yammering about them. We're here to remember Jenny. Don't want to hear another word. You're still going? I never decided not to. Well, I thought with Molly and everything, you know. Molly's coming with me. <laughs> you know, Nicole, big life decisions and grief, they don't mix. I proposed to Katie after Mia, and look what happened. I'm not asking you to talk me out of it. I'm telling you because your mate might say something. He did. I thought you had the wrong end of the stick. Just keep it to yourself. I want to tell my family when I'm ready this time. You know, you can make a fresh start nearer than Toronto. Well, that's up to me, isn't it? What funny pink bike helmet she had. <laughs> she, she looked like Penelope, um, what's her face? <laughs> she did that. She wore a picture. Not in her wedding dress. I thought she looked stunning. 
a laugh when she sang. Ah, oh. oh, she had some pipes. <laughs> She's amazing. Then why her? To our genesis. <laughs> well, a big heart and a ah, big laugh. We love you, girl. But you had to go, and, well... So, you have a drink with the big fella upstairs. <laughs> but don't forget us. We'll never forget you, sweetheart. To Jenny. 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 to you, says. I love you. I miss you. Good night, Jenny. She's not been the luckiest in love, but giving it one more shot, Sally's got all dolled up for her internet date in Coronation Street next. And Paddy's using tough love to prepare his kids for the big bad world of secondary school. Documentary My Dwarf Family is here in half an hour. <laughs>